I'm here with my buddy Ruby. In this video, we're going to show you how you can teach your puppy the play bow. Now, to do this, we're going to do this by shaping the behavior, which means we're going to do it in individual stages. Now, the first step is I want her to tuck her neck down. I don't want her to, uh, well, I, the end result is I want to put her to put her front chest on the ground with her butt up in the air. That's referred to as a play bow, uh, or what we call a play bow. And so basically, uh, it's too much criteria to ask all at once. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to, there we go. I just want her to tuck her neck in just a little bit. So I'm gonna make sure that she's orientated straight. Good. Actually, your word is nice, I'm sorry. Nice. And so we got a little bit of a uh, down already. Nice. Well, that was actually, that's more going down. We want them to tuck their neck, not to go down. So, get yeah, nice. 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 Well, she took a step back. We prefer they don't take a step back. So let's see if we can do that again. Nice. There, that was a good one, Ruby. You like that Charlie Bear, huh? Nice. You'd like a little bit more neck tuck, though, please. Oh, nice. That was part of one. So if your puppy gives you what you want, you make sure you mark that and give them the reward. Even if it's accidental, they didn't mean to do it, doesn't matter. That's what we're looking for. Nice. Oh, that was not nice on my part. Nice. I don't know why I said it so weird. Nice. Nice. Almost had it completely. She laid down, but that's what we're looking for. Nice. Nice. Yeah. She moves away. Just invite her to come back to you. Nice. So this is something that might take several practice sessions. That's okay. A lot of people get very frustrated. The dog's not doing it right away. Nice. Those videos you see online of the dog's doing it, they probably practice it a dozen times. So she's turning her head. So I want to stop and I want her to be straight orientated towards me. Yes, I want you to get it too. Nice. Yep, I'm twisting aren't you, aren't I? Nice. 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 That's kind of sloppy nice, but we'll take it. You're being very rough on my hands. So if your puppy is really aroused like this, I'm gonna ask for a sit. See how her energy just dropped? Yeah. So we're helping her relax a little bit. Up. Sit. down. So if your puppy is overly, is really excited, that's not a good time to practice this. Maybe you take your puppy for a little bit of a walk, let him go sniff around the backyard. Come. Sit. Until you get that nice calm energy again, and then come back and practice it. You always, when you're practicing these, you always want to end on a good note. So if your puppy is frustrated and you're not have, getting the results you're wanting, you're going to get frustrated. Your puppy's not going to want to do that. Well, let's see if we can go back to this a little bit. Nice. Wait for her to get done chewing. Nice. See if we can achieve one more on camera. Nice. Getting there. Ah, took a step back. Orientate you sideways so it's easier for people at home to see what's going on. Nice. Ruby's like, I'm going to get all those treats out of your treat pouch before I actually do it. And you sit. See that energy spiked again. So I waited, this time I gave her a sit, she went into a down, so I didn't reward the sit, but I waited before I reinforced, because I like the down as well, but I wanted her energy to a little bit relax. Sit, down, down. Let's try that again. Nice. Nice. Almost there, Ruby. Nice. There you go. Now, when you get to the point where your dog is consistently going to that play bow and they're not laying down, then you could actually say uh, bow or whatever the command word is that you want to use for this and then lure them into that particular position. 
Uh, now, when you're doing this, it's going to take a little bit of time. And this is a fun one, but just do it. Like I said, make sure that you're happy and you're enjoying the act of the process. Nice. Look at that. So as you, that's the, the benefit of when you do positive dog training, eventually your dog starts doing it more and more often because that's what gets them nice, the reward. And when you catch that, that wave as I'm calling it, nice, ride it. Uh, don't overdo it, but nice. Not quite exactly where I want, but nice. We're getting there. All right, well, this is my buddy Ruby, and this is how you can teach your puppy the play bow. Quest, you are a goofball.